Oh, MG, I can't control my excitement. Oh, MG, let's hope the video is absolutely fine. Anyways, let us go ahead and install Android 12. Yes, Android 12 alpha build by the Pro Shiva AOSP extended on the Poco F1. So here it is, Poco F1. I will be installing from .OS official build 5.2. And of course, super important thing, make sure you read the pinned comment. This is an alpha build. Do not expect it to be perfect. If you have the expectation of it to be a perfect build, feel free to use Android 11 for now. Now, what are the files which you need? All the files which you need are linked in the description of this video. So for starters, you do need AOSP extended alpha build Android 12. Then if you're device is decrypted you need disable force encryption if your device is encrypted you will have to perform a format data then you need google apps we are using the homemade google apps by the pro shiva over here and to flash all of this you do need twrp recovery by oof gang and the gang which is going to ask me can we do this with any other recovery the answer to that is no use the recovery recommended by the developer next thing battery of course needs to be charged 50 to 60 percent make sure you do have a backup of all your pictures videos anything important which you have on your device then you can always go into settings remove your google account people ask me why are we removing the account feel free to not remove it and sign back into the account on initial setup also remove any security measures anything which you have set up on your device like fingerprint face unlock and this here are the menus for aosp based rom you will have to of course look for these options if you are switching from from me UIs. and of course in my excitement i did forget about telling you how to check whether your device is encrypted or not so go into settings security here and encryption and credentials for me it says phone not encrypted which means i am going to flash disable force encryption if for you over there it says your device is encrypted then you need to perform a format data again if your device is encrypted you need to perform a format data if your device is not encrypted then download disable force encryption next up let us go ahead and boot into our recovery so turn off your device and once the device is turned off press and hold press and hold power and volume up till you see the recovery logo so here it is we have booted into our recovery now do note this right now is twrp 3.5.1 however we need to switch over to the recovery which is recommended by the developer so go into install install image navigate to the folder where you have downloaded all the files in case you download them on your phone directly they will be in the download folder here it is twrp by oof gang select this and then select recovery and then swipe to confirm flash once that is done tap on the home button reboot and select recovery if it gives you the message of no os installed ignore that swipe to reboot and now we should boot back into our recovery which of course should be twrp recovery by oof gang and there it is you can see on the top twrp recovery 3.4 by oof gang and this is the version which you need to use next up wipe advanced swipe dalvik cache system vendor and data and then swipe to wipe once that is done we are going to tap on the home button go into install by default it is in the download folder if not again navigate to the folder where you have downloaded all the files let me go back to the download folder first of all of course android 12 unofficial alpha build aosp extended select the zip file add more zips of course we need google apps and we are using the homemade apps by the pro shiva select that swipe to confirm flash now once the files have flashed make sure you got no errors so here it is we are flashing the rom itself script succeeded result was one then we are flashing google apps and as you can see there were no errors here either next up you're going to tap on the home button and before you ask me hey manji what about the firmware feel free to flash the firmware zip but i am assuming at this point everybody should be on the latest firmware then we will go into mount because my device was decrypted make sure you tap on vendor this is checked home button install disable force encryption swipe to confirm flash if your device was encrypted you will have to go into wipe format data type in yes tap on the check mark on the bottom right of course format data will result in wiping out of all your pictures videos anything important which you have on your device make sure you have a backup of all those things now for me 
device was decrypted i have already flashed disable force encryption reboot and select system if you get the messages about installing twrp and all those things uncheck and select do not install and there it is we have the boot animation on our poco f1 which means we are booting into android 12 of course alpha build by the pro shiva aosp extended and the first boot up might take some time so you have to be patient oh yeah aosp extended in the building omg yep there is no initial setup wizard because we are using homemade Google Apps by Shiva. Anyways, let us go into settings. We can go into about phone. Bam, bam, bam. Android 12 in the building. Kernel is Shiva's no name. Build date is of course October 8th and Android security patch is from October 2021. And there it is. We have successfully installed Android 12 alpha build by the Pro Shiva AOSP extended on our Poco F1. And guess what? Why was I using Shiva's apps? Because it has Pixel Launcher in the building. Let us check select. Bam. Working without any issues. Screenshot. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That will do it for this video. Hope my video helped you. Likes, shares and subscribes are appreciated. Feedback and comment more than welcome. See you when I see you.